so this is a video to accompany the shape work we're doing. Okay, so this is the first of perhaps two videos looking at shape. Um, oh, you've got a good half term anyway. So here we are. Um, let's get straight to it. All right, so shapes are everywhere. Um, and they've been around for a long time. So uh, I'm just going to show you a few pictures uh, which you'll probably recognise. So take a look at this. I'm sure you all recognise those and, um, and can tell me what shape they are. So, uh, and they're very old, aren't they? Yeah, I mean, you know, thousands of years old. So those uh, Egyptian people knew what they were doing with shapes there, didn't they? Um, and most of you will recognise that too and see different shapes here. Um, now, I mean, this monument um, was started well before those pyramids that we saw previously. Um, uh, but anyway, but these great big stones that we see are, are a little bit later, um, thousands of years or so after this monument was began. But anyway, it's the shapes we're after. So shapes there, look. Now, this is a Greek building. Um, lots of different shapes in that, actually, if you look closely. Um, when we're back at school, I can tell you something very exciting uh, about the Greeks and what they discovered about shapes. Um, anyway, there we are. So there's lots of shapes there. See, um, pause this video and see how many different shapes you can count in that one. All right. Um, now, I don't know if you know what that building is. That's, the, that's one of the oldest buildings in Britain, or one of the oldest stone buildings in Britain, anyway. Um, not the oldest, but um, certainly the oldest building in London, the oldest stone building in London. Um, anyway, see if you can find out. But look, all the different shapes. I mean, they've really gone crazy. I mean, that was built, ooh, I don't know, what, about a thousand years ago, something like that. Um, anyway, there's that one. And then, um, and of course, this is uh, a very old church. It's in Wales. Um, and even there, you can see different shapes. Okay, some nice shapes, actually, that one as well. All right, and some unusual shapes. Um, uh, but there we are. So, anyway, this is all meant to be about shapes in nature. So why am I looking at man-made stuff? Well, just to sort of bring shapes alive to you. Okay, so if I go in here, hopefully you'll be able to see this. Um, let's take a look at uh, let's take a look at my bike. All right, so there's my bike. Um, there it is. Um, now already you should be able to see some different shapes. Yeah. So my bike is made. Yeah, with different shapes. Now this one, uh, five sided shape. One, two, three. Oh, it's a four sided shape. So I beg your pardon. Um, so it's an irregular, irregular quadrilateral. Yeah triangles back there okay circles obviously um so and then and then peculiar shapes all over here as well so some more circles 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 yeah and then down there can you get that one can you get that i don't know if you can get that uh what's going on there is that working don't or oh, what's he doing mr sweeney you gotta go back a bit There, can you get that? Get that hexagon in there? Anyway, so shapes everywhere. So what about shapes in nature? Right, I'm gonna take you out into my garden and we're gonna have a quick look. Okay, so here we are. Um, just a couple of quick shapes for you because this is your task, right? To go out somewhere into your garden and get some pictures of some shapes. We go to the park when you go for a walk, something like that, with shapes in nature, okay? Um, I'll, I'll be quite happy for you to, um, to do me some man-made shapes as well, if you want to, all right? Um, anyway. So, what shapes have we got here? Well, we've got there some circles, yeah? I'd say, those daisy shapes. This is absolutely blooming lovely. Don't know if you can get that. That there, so lovely. Look at that lovely arc there we've got on that poppy stem, yeah? And um, and this, this is the seed head of a poppy. Can you see that in there? Isn't that lovely? I mean, that's quite complex, actually. Yeah, but still a very, very nice, very, very nice shape. All right, and uh, if you look behind me, you can probably see my apes with, with that's more man-made stuff. But let's see what we can find over here. See if we can find any more different shapes in nature. What can we see? Can we see? Oh, some bees there. Well, look, there's some peculiar-looking shapes. Aren't they? Some seeds coming on those aquilegias. I mentioned those before. All right, and then leaves all come in different shapes. Look. So this oval shape, it's like the shape of an eye almost. Teardrops and some some very straight things there. All right, and um, and and one of the other things to do is to look at. Where's my stinging nettle's gone? 
over here. Got some stinging nettles. Oh look, this that's quite a cool shape. You see that? Look, that's almost like a sphere with some hairy bits on it. But me stinging nettles. Oh look, I was looking for some of these the other day. Look, I don't know if you can see them. Look, there's some little spheres, they're little seeds. Can you see that on there? I don't know if you can. It, they've got to grow a little bit bigger. But anyway, but there's some little seeds, little round seeds. And on the stinging nettle, this is stinging nettle, the stem of a stinging nettle, I'm going to pull that bit off there without getting too stung. The, yeah, the stem of a stinging nettle is actually sort of hexagonal. Yeah, don't even make that out. But anyway, so, um, so, oh, blimey. So get out there and take a little look at some shapes in nature, hey? Glorious weather, all right? Anyway, good luck.